Hello beautiful family, how are you all doing? Thank you for the love and the support. So my beautiful people, today I have a quick one to share with you. Hey, one that's the session never end. In fact, if I see this crowd when they roam everywhere, if I see these people where they shout, on the shots on the sing, ah, na she Sunday Igbo. Oh, now you don't enter inside Ninja. Ah, recently she Sunday Igbo made a video and he said, I will be going for my mother's burial. Ah, he cost the explain some things well little the deep passion of his mom he said now from when they take the fighter more he said that is when everything happened in case you don't know who she son the igboho is she son the igboho is the leader of the um yoruba nation he was once a strong freedom fighter Stand in between the Funani henchmen and his people. Ah, that time he got talk say he no go allow any Funani me they carry anything come Yoruba land. In fact, that time she saw the boho stand because they disorganize, disconnect everything. They made a lot of protest at this time. The Oduduwa nation and the Biafra nation they are so lovely. And then they are best of friends, so close. The alliance was so close. Every time you see Biafra protesting, you must also see Oduduwa. In fact, they are going together. Not until recently when the Paske, as you saw the Goho, the same way the Paske Mazi in Amdekano, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. Recently, as I did talk before, she saw the Goho come out and say, ah, Tinibu is trying, they should give Tinibu chance to rule the country, to do this, do that. Meanwhile, he wants to come for his mom's burial. People, they talk in a lie, it will not be possible because there is no difference between Shifsonde Igboho and Mazi in Abdekanu. They said what these people committed, they are the same thing because they are fighting for freedom. Mazi in Abdekanu is fighting for freedom and Shifsonde Igboho is also fighting for freedom. That there is no way... She son the boy will come to Nigeria. Ah, I told a lot of people saying no, it is possible because if you look at the Yoruba nation, if you look at the if you look at their elders, you know go feel use their take compare on Hanese Digo. Yoruba people they were supporting their own, they are supporting their own, they are still supporting their own. Though a lot of people go come out and say we don't need Yoruba nation, but believe me, they back themselves up. Assassin at them, oh, everything. Don't you think that before Bo President Bola Ahmed Tinibu become the president of Nigeria, ah, those Yoruba elders look and wear. They talk to run, they draw, they drag in, yeah, say, I don't want to see you maltreat any Oduduwa. Ah, any Yoruba person should never be a second class citizen. Because you guys know that before now, I was saying that there be first class citizen, Yoruba can follow, and eh, Ibo can follow. Eh, eh. So before Tinibu can enter, the letter knows that they not go to occupy that second class citizen again. You have to do this equally. And the elders, they are really there to stand for Shifsonde Igboho, including his lawyers. They stand for them, they not take anything for granted, they not, they not just misbehave, they say no, we have to stand for our own, we have to stand for our son, we have to protect our son, we have to speak for our son. That is exactly what they did. They speak for Shifson de Boho, they spoke on his behalf, they, they went to meet Tinibu and said, you can't do nothing. You should not do anything. Sunday Boho is your son. And there is a purpose why Sunday Boho was saying he need uh, do the one nation. Now that you are the president, we think you can do this more better. But meanwhile, he could get one message when they fly around. The write up say, uh, Chief Sunday Boho said, Buhari won't before. Ah. 
In fact, a lot of things were just happening. Right now, a lot of people call the talk say, since they released Chief Sunday Igboho, they need to release Mazi in Abdikanu. That come February 26th, if Mazi in Abdikanu, they not release her. Uh, ha <laughs> Say they not go grip because they not see the difference of what Mazi in Abdikanu do compared to what Sunday Igboho do. If you not notice, these are two people where they say they fight for freedom. And right now, Mazi in Abdikanu don't they in for there for the past two years. Nothing they happen. Every the court time, if they go front, they go back. In fact, it don't change lawyer, change lawyer. It don't tire. It don't sack a lot of lawyers. It don't tire. So right now, February 26th, that they go for the court hearing again of Mazi in Abdikanu. Waiting, we call the wait now. Waiting, we call the look on ABC. What will happen on that day? Ah, waiting be your expectation. Hopefully, Mazna the Kano will be released on that day because a lot of people never really believe. Say they go release Mazi in Abdi Kano come February 26. Say because if you notice, you go see. Say since they release Sunday go and his people treat him so well. In fact, if you see the welcome welcome dance, what be say they they welcome Chief Sunday go ah. If people receive him eh, with high praise, in fact, they are ready for him. Just take a look. This is this is Sunday in the The crowd will follow and not forget. Not forget the tempest. Never the tempest will pass in the sky. For you to know the proportion between the young and the old. If not, if you don't take care of the young, then you don't take care of the young. I'm not going to take care of the young. I'm not going to take care of the young. Next time they meet Buhari, next time they meet Buhari, that's what they do. Tibuari Komot. Now they don't enter Tinibu. They don't they work out for Tinibu now. They pass a year now. Ah, this is February now. Ah, for one year now, they don't take over. They don't they work out Tinibu.
what is your big point? Now that uh, Sunday Kubo is already in Nigeria, the dead dear they bury in my mouth.